this was a problem, you know. Uh, the, the back story was that uh, Sundowns uh, saw him and uh, there was a little bit of a fight there. I'm not going to go in. We, we had their big bosses coming here and, uh, you know, we had to in intervene and say, okay, we'll go to Pirates, but then I'll go to Sundowns. So, because, you know, the way they just came up, you know, this the, this boys it was just unbelievable because people saw them and they was taking their time and boom after uh, Pirates Cup it was just a fight but uh, you know the the, bo the boys are exceptional both of them and uh, we're just hoping that we, with their new clubs now they will they will able to take them to the next level. You're saying he's, he's still playing for under 15 here? He's 15. At the school? Yeah. <laughs> and he's under 17 there already? No, yeah. Look, we... There was a great... I had a, a debate with, with the under 19. Well, it was not a debate. It's something that I was just saying he must do. To say, look, uh, this boy, we're just wasting his time at under, under 15. We need to push him to under 19. As a result, when we went to engine, he was called up to go with the under under 18 to engine, you know, and he, he scored a couple of goals. He, he played, uh, I think, about almost all the games there. So he's just a marvel, you know, and uh, that's why even the teams were fighting for him because players like him are very hard to come by. People really do their work. You know, uh, you know, my banner is the same. I, you know, I was sharing it with Coach James. Uh, people used to talk about my banners like, nah, man, I haven't I seen, you know, maybe it's because I don't, maybe when they are playing, my team is playing. And I was like, no, I haven't seen, you know. And one day, uh, I, I get to coach, because sometimes you find a situation where uh, as coaches, we need to split, you know. So I get to coach his team. And this player was just on fire, and I was like, yeah, you know, I, I don't know how I missed it. But people there, they follow the school, they send their scouts. Uh, you know, I mean, I remember when I was speaking to a guy from Pirates, he was even coaching the places he has seen my band. I was like, ah, you know, I don't remember seeing them, but uh, he, he was there. And, you know, the same with Sundowns, they can tell you, no. We saw him there, there, we saw him that place, we saw him that tournament, you know. So people really do, you know, they are scouting quietly, you know, they are not on Twitter, they do it quietly. And sometimes they see this potential even before we as coaches here see. Remember we conduct trials um, throughout um, the country. So, you know, we go to places where uh, team, professional teams would not necessarily go, scouts would not necessarily go. So this is how we find these boys. That's why uh, we, with our uh, scouting program, we, we hardly compete with anyone because where we go, people they don't want to go. You know, So we are able to find uh, these players uh, uncontested and work with them, you know, uh, uh, slowly. And, and then they start blossoming and then that's where the fights comes because now people see the true potential of the players.